what's happening. Is um, being in a small town, especially up north in BC, like middle of butt crack nowhere. Butt cracks. I know. I so appreciated all the anus talk. And <laughs> You know, the way that was presented on stage was actually more efficient than what I tried to do. <laughs> <laughs> Are you trying to ask me? Yeah, ask me. Like, what I did, I ended up like punching myself. <laughs> <laughs> so that was the old no, it was so funny. And I was the only one to laugh, so it was even worse. <laughs> yeah. It's even better when there's more people laughing at me because then I'm like, yes! Yes, I'm not alone. Thank you. Okay, I don't have to judge myself now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, uh, in a small town, when you have nothing really available to you to like vent all your like, teen or like young adult or old adult or dog or whatever you are, angst, you basically just find whatever's popular there. And I lived in Smithers, where like the whole community managed to block Enbridge, like 10,000 people alone managed to block Enbridge. I know, and I'm just like, I live there. <laughs> so that's like, yeah, that's, that's enough for me to be a cool person. No, but come I on. performed at this festival called 4,000 Reasons, and I'd written this song like a year before, but I totally pretended that I had written it for that show because I <laughs> that bad at actually finishing songs. <laughs> so I performed this song there at 4,000 Reasons, like 4,000 Reasons Why You Should GTFO. <laughs> um, so this song was written when I actually first moved back to a small town from Vancouver, which is basically where I discovered myself, like beards and pompadours and <laughs> dragon. <laughs> yeah. And I was basically just like forced to go back after discovering myself to the place where I had never known what the word gay meant. I had never known that there were lesbians there. It was weird. <laughs> like, gay people don't exist here. <laughs> oh, in the making. <laughs> So I went back there, and I basically, like, after experiencing Vancouver, I just decided, you know what? I'm already a shy person. I should, like my old, my last song said, just say fuck it. And I just went all out, and I performed there at festivals, and I didn't die. <laughs> so I'm glad. <laughs> and uh, this song I performed there, it's called River Skin, and it's basically about. Um, questioning where you really come from. Because I was a kid that always moved around, so I didn't really have like a, oh, I'm from here. It's just kind of like, um, well, I've lived here and here and here. You've got 20 minutes? Okay. <laughs> yeah. So this is about figuring out who you are and what and where you come from. And whether that's uh, something to be happy about or not.
say 